So finally, we can work on situational tackling with the Jacks Tackler. Depending on what I see, I'm gonna use a different tackling technique. So if I see the numbers, I'm gonna do a square tackle. So I'm gonna approach, I'm gonna create a brace, drive with the shoulder, wrap it as I take it to the ground. If I don't see the numbers from the side, I'm gonna do a uh, angle tackle. So I'm gonna be aware of where the ball is. I can either punch here. If I simulate the ball is close, we can work on punching the ball out from the near side. You can also work a pursuit tackle with the Jacks Tackler. It's not a situation we normally wanna be in, but it's also something we don't train very often. So now I'm not as worried about the safety again, because rather than opposing forces you would see in traditional tackle drills, now we're running the same direction. So there's not gonna be a lot of force in the tackle. What you wanna tra train your players to do is close space as fast as they can, be aware of where the ball is, and they can punch at the ball as they wrap and drive the dummy to the ground. So we're able to do different situations very efficiently in the same drill.